Hey everybody, it's Gio Aritas here from the Real Estate Investment Division at Barrett & Company. And today we're out at 9587 Polini. This is a beautiful house. I'm so excited to have this as a listing. And I'm actually uh, coming to you today with a super cool extra feature. I'm actually here with the owner. His name is Mitch. Mitch, say hello. Hello. Mitch is going to also talk us through some of the finer points of this incredible house that has got some very cool upgrades to it. So. We're gonna start out, you guys are having a little, little shot of the uh, the house right here. It's a two car garage, correct Mitch? Correct. Awesome, tell us a little bit more about some of the features that you've got out here, some of the things you were telling me about, like the Christmas light hookups. You've got a, a, a pole over here, a flagpole over here, that is very cool, and he was telling me earlier that he's put up all sorts of flags from the times, and so the homeowner association is pretty relaxed and you can have some fun. He had a pirate party, threw up a pirate flag on it. Um, just all sorts of cool stuff, but those are the things that really make a property like this worth living in. So tell us a little bit, Mitch. Well, the outside, obviously all the landscaping is, is fairly new and updated. Uh, there are drip systems throughout the property. Um, in the front for Christmas lights or for holiday parties and stuff, we have um, electrical outlets strategically placed all over it so you can plug things into it. There's actually speakers for the front here so that if you want to play music, you can do all of that. Um, on, the, on the body of the house, there are electrical outlets for the different levels of the roof so that you can power up uh, Christmas lights from up there without having to run cords everywhere. Also, the house was just repainted, what, about 30 days ago? Yeah, about 30 days. About 30 days ago. Like, these are the kinds of features you're going to see in this house um, right here. Just look at little lights on your walking path going up the stairs here. You know, one thing I can say um, is that really the touches and the finishing touches in this house you did a phenomenal job on Mitch I've always felt that that it's it just kind of went above the the normal level of upgrades so it's it's pretty cool so now we're gonna walk inside this is your front door you got one of these panoramic uh, peepholes which I think are really cool and boom here we are in the entryway Mitch tell us a little bit about this room and while you do I'm gonna I'm gonna show the viewers some of the nice touches like the European switches that are in here and the style elements of these receptacles and such that the fine minute attention to detail that's in here. Well, we, we have the gas fireplace for just making it more of a sitting room in the, in the living area space here. We have all LED or halogen lighting throughout the property. Um, everything has been switched over to low energy. Um, There'll be accent lights built into most of the cabinetry and most of the locations. In this area here, you'll also see the speakers for the uh, whole house um, audio. Uh, so we have speakers for this room, for the family room, uh, and in the kitchen and out on the patio. They blend right in. Yeah. It took me a second to, <laughs> it yeah. took me a second to find it. So yeah, those like, are boxes there. Uh, so that you can get access to the speakers and take is, them in and out. Is that like a china cabinet? There that is, is uh, one side is designed for, for that. The other side has linens and pull-out drawers for all the oh, uh, linens, that. napkins, napkin rings, and all this that. such. That's cool. Built-ins right here, look at that. Uh, the nice other stuff. one is your entry closet so that you can have coats and stuff in here as well, hats Sweet. and all that stuff. Um, this area, the chandelier, I assembled that about a year and a half ago uh, with the LEDs. Uh, it's all glass balls uh, with fish line, and uh, at nighttime it really sparkles, so it's a, it's a real beaut. Yeah, definitely check out the photos on that. Thanks for reminding me, Mitch. Check out when we post the photos up on the listing because we're going to have some, some shots with the, uh, all the lighting on and all the very cool... He's got color changing and mood adapting lights in here. It's very neat. Look at this. So all these cabinets down here, and there's uh, five of them, I remember. Yeah, five cabinets, different sizes. They're all designed to hold like your buffet. It's uh, got glassware, chinaware, some miscellaneous serving items in there. It's all tiled in, built in. That's cool. Awesome. Cool. Take us into the yeah, kitchen. And all the uh, window coverings and everything stay. They're designed for this house. So hopefully uh, you cool. like circles. Cool. Okay, and check this out here. We've got a built-in TV um, right here. And the reason for it is, here I'll get you out of the picture. The reason for this is 
We used to throw family pictures and everything else up here, or if we're sense. doing an event or something, we would have Christmas movies and, opens, and everything else here. And it opens up to here, and so you've got this ability to really get creative with this screen on the wall here, which is very cool. So that stays, too. Yeah, that stays. And then let's just walk around the, the kitchen here. So we've got tons of storage up here. We've got some LED lighting up at the top, too, which is Under fantastic. cabinet lighting, both sides. Awesome. And that you can kind of get a shot of the pool from out here, which we will take you out to go see. And they just did a really nice job. You guys did a real nice job with all of your upgrades in here. Look at this. Cabinets all the way up to the ceiling. And yes, guys, that is a colored light up there, which is, can change. It's very cool. Look at this. Tons and tons of cabinetry. This is a kitchen dream. Um, we've got dual convection oven here as well as yep. convection, correct? Convection microwave and there, convection, microwave convection as well. and gas range on that side. Awesome. It's um, a house designed to be uh, do entertaining. You got a nice island here in the uh, in the kitchen. They've got some stools around it. Plenty of space. Really a big kitchen. And a nice open floor plan for the split model because now we're going to go down just a couple steps here into a sunken would just be a family room, yeah, a living room. Family it's a family room, room here, right? Um, here's a cool feature. This entire house is. Tell us about it's. It's all wired. For, it's all sound. You have a surround uh, system in the house. Yes, or? we have a uh, speaker amplifier there just for speaker zones. It can go up to I believe six. I have three in. It is wired for the master bedroom awesome. to have a set of the wires are there, but they're not no speakers. Awesome, awesome, awesome. The bar. Look at this bar. It's fantastic. And the two coolers, the white cooler and the the, the white cooler and the beverage cooler are also sticking around. Yeah. Um, Looking we'll at a nice close up of this. The cool thing here, too, with this photo, with this painting here on the left, this piece of art, is yeah, go ahead, you can remove it. It hides the entire guts for the IT infrastructure. Yeah, the router, your, your, router, router, your routers, switches, and stuff right here your speaker fantastic. connections, and everything else. Are in it's here. a really great bar, great entertaining. And then, boom. This property in this neighborhood has got extra square feet because a long time back they uh, they did an addition on it. This is the downstairs bedroom, which has its own access out to the pool. And you know what, bitch? What, what, since we're right here, we may as well just walk out and uh, and get out. Thanks for helping me unlock that. So here's the yard, and you got two entrances. You got one from the sunken family room. And we got a great pool here. The bar, you got the built-in barbecue out here. Yeah, and it's uh, gas, it's not propane. There was a the hot tub is there. So it's wired for power over there. It is wired for it power wired over for power. over here. It's wired for yeah. power, so if you want so to put a hot tub in. Hot tub in so you get the cool equipment behind the little wall. We've got a great little pathway here leading to uh, your air conditioning units, which are ground mounted and uh, way out there. In fact, I'll put you up. This is, this is the unit that's just for this little room. So it's got its right. own complete, you know, makes you really did everything the right way. That's one thing that the buyers appreciate is that when you did upgrade your house, you did it all the right way. You didn't take any shortcuts, which is cool. Um, and then you've got some raised, oh yeah flowering um i love it yeah you got the raised garden over here it's all irrigated and you were telling me too uh, you got irrigation in both the front and back garden mm -hmm. already set up mm -hmm. it's on a time system it's too. on time so that's fantastic really got some great and then back here just like a little area that's been yeah, used for storage. overflow and storage and a couple of ladders this is yeah. perfect for that so this works out really well all right let's go back inside the house and let's go see the rest of it so the one thing too that I like is this is Silverado Ranch, correct? Yes, it is. This is Silverado Ranch, and so you've got um, a great homeowner association. But the cool thing about it is it's fourteen bucks a month, and driving up and down the neighborhood, as you guys, I'm sure if you're going to come see it, you'll do. It's the, every house is in great shape. The neighborhood is is kept up well. It's it's fantastic. All right, we're going to go upstairs now. Um, got a nice little pot shelf there as well, and um, shoes cool. Shoes cool. All right. So, going upstairs, and again, you see, you got the the high energy efficient LED lighting throughout. Great area up here. Is this the laundry room? Laundry room right here. Upstairs laundry. These are also staying. Hey, this is real life. Everybody does laundry. Everybody does laundry. It's okay. Um, 
So we've got a couple of bedrooms here. And I'm just going to span over so you can see the layout of the house. That's a walk-in closet yeah, or a reach-in? It's a little bit more of a reach-in. Yes. Oh, yeah, it's got no, built-ins in. and no, stuff. So. You can go in there. Nice. Built-in. So look at this. These are the kinds of touches you don't get in a lot of these houses in the neighborhood. This is also a nice touch. USB charging station, full controls of uh, the fan. We have fan lights in all bedrooms. And this one is a regular closet. Yes. And then you have an upstairs linen closet. And this is the upstairs bath, the shared bathroom. Jacuzzi tub. Yep. Great finishes. Floor to ceiling tile. Floor to ceiling tile, look at this. With the crown molding. Looks beautiful, I love it. I'm loving listening to this house, guys, if you can't tell. It's a lot of fun. It's a great place. That's the cool part about it. And that's why I got into this business for to give people great places to live. Vaulted, pitched roof here, vaulted ceilings as a result of it. Um, right back there is the sitting area. We'll walk in there in a second. That's part of the add-on. I'll show you the secret hiding place for extra storage that he put in there. And then your bathroom is located right there. So let's go walk in. Got a great little rotundra bathroom here, which is really fun. They don't do bathrooms like this much anymore and look at this you've got everything just within a couple of steps it's very cool you got the commode you got the walk-in closet back here the walk-in closet here goes back and around you've got other storage right here another shelving yeah. area and i put power in the cabinet so the hair dryers and everything can stay plugged that in that is cool and not out on the counters great there's um design features laundry here. baskets and then we have dry cleaning under this one so they're all, all, they're all on pullouts and all stuff. All built so. in. Very well designed, well thought through, and great finishes too. All the touches in the shower. And this has got body shower, overhead. Oh and yeah, and it's hand got, showers. look at this. It's got all kinds, you can have all kinds of Can I step shower. in? Yeah. I'm yeah. gonna step in, hold on. I'm gonna turn this thing it around. It is big enough for two. Boom, it is Barely. big enough for two. It's all, that's awesome. You got the shooters right here, the uh -huh. body shooters. You've got the, Hand sprayer. Look at they got the recess. I love that. We do that in all of our mm -hmm. in our investment oh, yeah. properties too. We put and that in the overhead. And, and you got the rain. Adjustable too. Boom. Awesome. Very cool. This is a great master bath. Lots of fun stuff in here. Very well thought through. The one thing I'd like too is the paneling that you did here. I love this. I never know what the right way to call this is. What is it? Do you know? It's so cool. It's a style line. I like the uh, it, the whole the wall. Old Tuscan look to it. You're good. Um, like that's cool. And then here, guys, is a very cool feature. And this is this is some of the square footage. You saw the downstairs bed, uh, added on bedroom. And now this is above that bedroom. And so here's some of the other square footage. This is why this house gets put on the top end uh, bigger than anything else in this neighborhood is because of this add-on. Awesome sunken. Here's a, just a couple of steps you can see. Awesome sunken in uh, little, well, you guys using it as like a sitting room it's and an sitting office. sitting office, yeah. It's set up for two workstations. Go show them the secret panel, yeah. I love this. Check this out. Boom. He just opened it up and I'm going to stick it in there. Is it lit? Yeah. <clears throat> You're kidding. You always, you did a great job. Where is the, here it is. Okay. It, you've got, boom, this alone. You just don't even get this in homes in Vegas, period. It goes, I'm going to turn it sideways. It goes all the way back as well. Um, thanks. And then also as a side result, Boom, you got a little balcony out of it. So let's walk out. It goes all the way back here. Bet you this is a fun place to yeah. look at the stars uh, and hang out. Well, and it's a great time to see uh, fireworks from the strip. So it, it, uh, it comes up right over the treetops and stuff. You can just ah, see the tops of the street. Very down cool. There. Look at this. And these things, if you take a look at the houses next to you, you don't have anything like this top balcony here. And that's just the extra little things that, that make this house such a hidden gem. And if you're looking for a property that is um, a, a top-end property with a lot of really great finishes and things like the built-in ironing board, ironing board behind, the power, yeah. behind the panel that blends in, and I didn't even know it was there. <laughs> it's, the knick-knack it's cool. cabinet for collectibles, and it's all lit. There's lights on top and bottom. Um, it's a great house. It's a great property that's got a lot of really unique uh, features to it. So if you're interested, you've got to come out and check this property out. 
It's fun. It's fun to show. So agents, make sure you show your show your clients if they want to live in the Silverado Ranch area um, or if they would consider. Come and check this property out. It is awesome. Thank you very much for watching. And uh, give me a call or a text with any questions.